current prosecutor chose to charge a 10-year-old boy with assault and battery because he hit somebody with a stick. You have to make a choice about whether you're going to sit and watch what plays out every single day that's full of hate and injustice, or are you going to actually try to do something about it? I've spent my whole life fighting for kids. From the minute I stepped into the classroom until I was seated in the courtroom. As a teacher, I saw how important a good education was and what a difference it could make in a child's life. But kids need more than teachers that care. Having my own children opened my eyes to what it's like being a mom, what it's like to worry about your kids' safety, about their future. I wanted to build that better future. So I decided to go to law school and serve as a prosecutor. I fought to keep predators off the street and keep our kids safe. During my career, I had a 100% conviction rate against child sexual assault offenders. I was relentless about getting justice for those kids, those families, and those survivors. As a family court judge, I helped families in distress. I helped keep kids out of the foster care system where we know they are the most vulnerable. And then, I helped make history. I presided over the first same-sex adoption in Michigan. But throughout my time on the court, I saw how our prosecutor's office was letting down our community. I do not charge unless I think that I can win that case. And I do not think that was criminal culp culpability. We never see anything that, that has to do with that type of racial disparity, particularly not in, in Oakland County. Our prosecutor refused to participate in drug treatment courts, even veterans treatment courts. Our county is lagging behind in criminal justice reform, continuing to pursue maximum sentences for nonviolent offenders. As a judge, I saw the current prosecutor put her personal agenda ahead of the public interest. I realized I couldn't watch this anymore. My whole life I fought for kids and families, and our community deserves better. Everyone deserves access to justice. No matter your race, religion, your age, or how you identify, you deserve a prosecutor who's fighting for you. That's why I'm running to be your prosecutor. If we put kids first, everything falls into place. Keeping our kids safe from violent criminals and keeping families together. And not wasting money locking people up for nonviolent crimes. Money that could be going to our schools and a better future for our kids. We can be a safe community and a just community. I'm Karen McDonald, and I'm a Democrat running for prosecutor.